Hello, we're 21 Pilots, and this is our most requested live Ask Anything chat. Thanks to Romeo for having us on the show tonight. Our new track is called Saturday. Marina from Thorold, Ontario says, how did it feel to get in front of all those people after such a long time? Were you guys emotional during it? Um, I did not cry. She's referring to our first show back. Uh, it was over 600 days of not playing a show, and then we finally played a show out in Milwaukee, and uh, it was an incredible feeling, but we didn't, cr I didn't cry. I didn't cry. I think the last time I cried was like the day before the show. It's been a while, <laughs> so definitely not, definitely not. Go ahead. All right, Jessica from Sweden, just Sweden. All of it. The people of Earth has decided that they are going to send out one TWP song <laughs> into space for the aliens. You have been chosen to pick out the song. What song would it be? Well, uh, first of all... People of Earth have decided, not has decided, so... Yeah, and TWP... I it's all right, she's from is. Sweden. Yeah, it's fine. It's Give fine. her a pass. Um, I think, I guess the song that would make sense would be Heathens, just so we can warn the aliens yeah. of what kind of people they're dealing with uh, yep. if they want to they come to Earth. Carisha from Durban, South Africa. Have you read any interesting fan theories about Scaled and Icy? No. No. Beth from Nashville, Tennessee says, if the answer on Jeopardy was 21 pilots, what was the question? Um, who are the, the world's most handsome boys? Yeah. What is 21 pilots? Uh, Josh from Iowa City. Will you be getting any scaled and icy related tattoos in the future? If so, what do you think it should be? I, I've actually thought of that. I might do that. Really? Yeah. Okay. I was thinking about getting a tattoo for each record. Is that dumb? No. No, it's not. Okay. Um, I, I want to get at least one TWP tattoo. Two TWP. Let's go. Carol. Carol from Lakewood, Colorado. I would ask a question, but on Saturday, 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 we paint the town. Thanks. Nice one, Carol. Great. Uh, Tashi from Trenton, New Jersey. Have you ever written the greatest song in your head and then couldn't translate it to notes and words? Not exactly, Tashi, but I have thought of some really great melodies uh, and sat down at the piano and played it and forgot to record, just thinking I would remember, and um, and they disappeared forever. So, yeah, so I, I've missed many a hit song. They were good in that moment, though. Yeah. That's what counts. Bendy from Hungary says, why is it called Takeover Tour? Well, that's a good question. This is a format that we've only done one time where we spend four or five nights in one city. Normally a tour is one night per city uh, where we we pull up and we play and we leave. This time we're pulling up, we play one show, then we go to the next show in the same city, and then the, the next show in the same city, and then the next show in the same city, and we play four or five shows. So we're basically taking over all the, the venues that we've played before in each city as we go. I don't know if that makes sense, but we're there for about a week at a time. Marina from Naples, Italy. Josh, how's your motorcycle? A waste of money. Diane Neria. I don't know if that's, sorry, did you want to answer that? Uh, a waste of money. <laughs> Diane Neria from L Lima, Peru. Is it Li Lima, right? Not Lima? Lima, Lima. I think. Do you know the exact color of pink that Tyler used for his hair? Uh, a waste of money. A waste of money. <laughs> uh, go ahead. Autumn from Richfield, Washington. How did you come up with Trash the Dragon? Ooh. I think he came up with us. Yeah, he came up with us. Uh, no, actually, in, in Dima, tra a trash dragon is kind of slang for a vulture. A little uh, tidbit for you. Uh, Serena from Galleon, Ohio. What was it like growing up in Ohio? It was amazing. Wouldn't you know? Yeah. Um, Violetta from Queens. Can you tell us a little bit about your early years starting out? Did you travel far away for tours? Early years starting out, we played right here in this room. Um, we did not travel very far away at all for, for tours. Um, we would travel pretty close to home. We worked jobs Monday through Friday and would play shows on the weekend in and around Ohio and uh, as things started to get bigger slowly over time we went further away from home and 
Now we just like being home. Uh, Kat from Ravensdale, Washington. I know you just released Scaled and Icy, but can we expect the next album sooner or later? Seder. Lunar. Steph from Boston, Massachusetts. What was the last song of yours that you two heard on the radio besides Saturday? And will you ever play Christmas Save to your life? You can't, you can't do two questions in one. Pass. Mm. Jorge from Mexico City. During the development of the album, how early did you start to conceptualize it? Too complicated. Taylor from Jonesboro AR. Is that Arkansas? Arkansas. Give us a comb over. What does that mean? Like yeah, this? you just comb it to the side. You're welcome, Taylor. <laughs> Soak it in. It. Soak it in. Ooh. Yeah, that's for Taylor. Uh, Mackenzie from <laughs> Titusville, Florida. What kept you guys the most entertained during quarantine? Uh, my kid. I had a, I had a baby girl. What about you? Mm, I guess playing the drums. All right, you can do one now. I'm sorry. I'll do one. I lead singer. I'm not going to do that one. Skip it. Oh, this is a question for me. It's oh, perfect. Skip. Oh, sorry. I didn't do it. Sophie from Muskego, Wisconsin. Josh, do you have any tips for beginning drummers? Just play. That's really it. That's all I did. I I don't I don't think that you need lessons. I never really had lessons. You might I might be better if I had lessons, but all you really have to do is play. And all you need is a pair of sticks, and that's pretty much it. Oliver from Laredo, Texas. This is a good, see, this is the question I'm looking for. These are good questions right here. What do you do when you have to yawn on stage? Great question. I've thought about this a lot, actually. I've never yawned on stage. I've never sneezed on stage. Um, and I'm trying to figure out why is that the case? Played so many shows, never yawned, never sneezed. I think it's something to do with the adrenaline of being on stage that suppresses those things from happening, wouldn't you say? Yes, but I will say I've done each of those things exactly one time. <laughs> Have you really? Yeah, and I remember. You sneeze? Yeah, I remember sneezing on B stage one Did time. Did you hit the crash symbol when you sneezed? <laughs> uh, no, I uh, I don't remember what song it was, but I remember being on B stage, and I remember thinking how odd that was because of that same thing, and I laughed afterwards because it was just you don't see people sneezing on stage. Yeah, that's funny. Um, Go ahead. Uh, Tara from Hunting West, Huntington, West Virginia. If you were on a dating site, what quality do you have that you would lead your profile off with? Um, I think I would probably say that uh, I, I, hmm, not a lot. Of, I don't have a lot of great qualities. <laughs> That's probably what I'd write. Wow. And then whoever whoever dates me then is is um, she's the one. Uh, but I'm married. Marin from Monterey, Mexico. Have you counted the number of shows you've done to date? Um, someone knows that. Yeah, we could get that number somewhere. I don't know how many. I mean, what would that be? How many shows did you put? A thousand. I think it's over a thousand. Uh, Daniel. Oh. Hey, Chris. How many shows have we played? Yeah. Guess. 1,500. So I was like a couple years off. Yeah. Daniel from Columbus, Ohio says, guys, are you ever going to play DLC again? DLC doesn't exist. Uh, it was yeah. bought by a different company, so I don't think that there's any possible way that that could happen, so I apologize. Curtis from Katy, Texas. Can you do signed, scaled, and icy CDs or vinyls, please? Uh, no. Nicolia from Parker, uh, Arizona says, why does Josh hate bananas? Well, because they're, they're god awful. They're gross. They're, what are you talking they're, about? here's the thing. This is the main issue with it is the, the mush of it when it's in your mouth. It's just squishing around. I, I don't even want you to talk about it. Uh, you should hate him too. I got nothing left. Oh. Um, Jay from Weatherford, Texas. Why has Regional at Best never been out on Spotify? Thank you very much. 
Thanks to Most Requested Live and Romeo for having us on the show tonight. Our new song is called Saturday. We'll see you out on the road. Seriously, thanks for the questions. Yes, thank you. We wish we could do more, but you guys couldn't think of anything better than that.